Hey guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to draw the Lewis dot structure for the di iodide uh, compound. Alright, so here we go. The uh, formula for that is just going to be I2. Alright, so this is basically the diatomic for iodine. Alright, that's going to give us uh, two iodines each with seven valent electrons for a total of 14 valent electrons okay so basically what we have we have the two iodines here and we can start off by single bonding them together and then filling in the octets on each of the atoms and if you count the electrons you have two four six eight ten twelve fourteen which is what we have in the total so this is actually going to be our final structure we can verify that by checking the formal charge so on the iodine and notice they both have six non-bonding electrons in, in one single bond so their formal charges will be equal so the formal charge will be the seven valence brought in minus the one single bond minus the six non-bonding electrons for a formal charge of zero multiply that by two because there are two of them still results in an overall formal charge of zero which is what we need because this is a non-charged compound or particle all right um, in terms of shape, because there's only two atoms, that makes this a linear um, molecule or compound, okay? Um, in terms of hybridization, looking at either of the iodines, they both have one, two, three, four, or one, two, three, four electron groups, which means we need four hybrid orbitals. So we're going to go with sp3 hybrid. So you have 1s and 3ps for a total of four hybrid orbitals to match up with the four electron groups on each atom. And uh, because these are both the same kind of atom, they're both iodines, their polarities will cancel out, making this a non-polar compound. Okay, uh, that is pretty much it for this one. If you have any questions, please let me know. And thanks for watching.